Hey YouTube, what's going on? Firefish back is here to bring you guys yet another live reaction. Um, this is gonna be to One Piece episode 769. Uh, don't know what the title is because the usual website I use to watch One Piece on um doesn't. But uh, also um, just want to let people know um, I am gonna go see One Piece Film Gold um on January eleventh or twelfth. One of those two. Um not exactly sure um which day exactly I'm going. Uh gonna be picking up my tickets um Monday. Well not really me, um my my girlfriend or my ex or whatever we are. Um she is gonna buy them for my birthday. Because my birthday is technically since it's after one in the morning because this is it's been a while since um uh you know, uh it, it took me a few minutes to find this episode. But uh yeah, my birthday's in ten days. Um and uh I got done, I today I also watched uh Rogue One twice. Uh went we seen it twice and loved it. Um, but you know what, enough about that, you guys aren't here hear about that but um let me know in the comments down below are you guys gonna go see uh one piece film gold and um how excited are you about it um me i haven't looked up anything um about the story or anything um other than what i've seen in the trailers um i know nothing about it um and i'm very excited for it um let me know um, what your thoughts and opinions are going into One Piece Film Gold. Um, if you guys have already seen it in uh, the subtitle, because I know the subtitle I think came out, uh, either came out or it's coming out like in the next, uh, little, no, I, I believe it already did come out in Japan. Um, so uh, yeah, anyway. Uh, sorry about this blabbering, guys. Uh, just wanted to get that out. And yeah, let's jump right into this episode. Toei Animation. You know, I'm day. And it's being a little weird and buffering on me. I don't like the... I used to use this site I'm using right now. Um, like, all of the time. But then, uh... Ended up finding a better site, so uh, yeah. Just skipping ahead right now, I'm at 3 minutes and 48 seconds. Luffy and the others arrived at Zo, an island where their new adventure will take place. The enormous island, which is as high as the clouds as its name suggests, a Zo elephant that has been alive for a millennium. <clears throat> so we got introduced to uh, Rizo. Uh, last chap, I mean last chapter, <laughs> last episode, uh, we also got the revelation about the Kozuki clan and the minks being practically family for many, many years, and that uh, Momonosuke and Kinemon are actually not father and son, but Momonosuke is the rightful heir to be Dynamo, Dynamo in uh, Wano Kuni. So we see them walking down the stairs. <laughs> Is that? That's Rizo's voice. What? The ninja? Ninja? And we see all the, the panels of the ninja, what they expect them to be like. Yahoo, where's the ninja? Uh, we have Chaparusa, Luffy, and Frankie. Here we are. Higara, the ninja Rizo. There you are, Cat Viper. You, why didn't you just hand me over to them? Everyone that brought me food here was injured. They told me the country is okay, but is it true? If it's a lie, I, Rizo, will hate you. And then we see Rizo and the images of the ninja 
flashing back and forth, and then the image shatters. What? He's nothing like we expected. <laughs> oh man, really? Wah. So, the title card ending this week is at 5 minutes and 40 seconds. <sighs> Why is it that with One Piece? they do this but with Dragon Ball Super it's like two minutes at the most maybe two and a half minutes because the opening is literally like a minute but uh... yeah anyway let's jump into the episode right now what's the title a red stone a guide to the one piece Woo! here it is guys so Raj is struggling in the chain so he's tied to that red stone. Hey, what in the world has happened, Cat Viper? Forgive me, Rizo. We had no choice. Rizo's just crying still. <laughs> Look at you, sub chopper, and Frankie are on the ground like they got hit by Perona's negative ghost. That's a disappointment. And then Law is just like, his face is huge. Does it seem like a fast runner? Is that Rizo? I can't accept a ninja like that. I don't think you guys are from this country. Who are you? Ka! Oh! Rizo! Oh! Gimon, Kanjiro, Momonosuke sama! And he's all happy and smiling. I'm glad that you're okay. We're glad you're okay too. Raizo! And there they are. They're all smiling and they're actually. Sorry to keep you waiting, Raizo. I'll unchain you now. Thanks. So now he's unchained. Huh? And Luffy's just looking at him weird. <laughs> Usopp and Chopper. Frankie and Zoro. Even Law is just... <sighs> What's your problem, you bastards? And they're all Usopp and then we're looking at him. Uh-oh, here's Robin, Nami, and Brooke. Uh-oh, what's Robin gonna do? Look at this place. Oh, Robin sees it. That's... Kozuki Clan Mark. The crest of the Kozuki family. The same as Kimimon's. That crest has existed for centuries. And that stone is. I've never seen it in such a color. Deep red? Yeah, it's a poneglyph. Robin, just looking at it. We know you, Gara, Nico, Robin. I heard the O'Hara people can read those letters. So you two know about O'Hara? The sad music's playing. Oh, then we get a little flashback of Robin. I really hope this is something we haven't seen before. We see it. So they're all studying the Poneglyph. Oh, they're making a copy of it, too. Oh, and there's Robin grabbing a book with her ability. And reading the book. Oh, so she had this ability. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure she did. So she's got her eyes on the wall and reading the page. 
is of the book and looking at the poneglyph. Here, this proves that you're a scholar. Take this, Robin. I'm happy for you, Robin. Congratulations. Listen, Robin, you must understand well what it means to be an archaeologist. Yes, Professor Clover. Oh, and then we see the bus to crawl and everything again. Just them attacking. Oh, and the tree falling down. And then Robin sailing away. Why is that poneglyph red? None of the poneglyphs I've ever seen were that color. One, two, three, four. So we've seen all the four poneglyphs that Robin's seen. It has a different purpose. Can you read it? Yes. May I? She's smiling. Of course you may. And Robin's all smiling and running right up to it. She's looking at it. And then they're all just looking at Ryzo still. What's wrong with you guys? Why are you staring hard at me like that? Are you really a ninja? How insolent. Who are you? We haven't introduced them to you yet. Ryzo, they're the Straw Hats. They're pirates. Pirates? If you're a real ninja, throw a shuriken. Meditate under a waterfall. Say nin and use ninja powers. I want to see the earth escape technique. I want to see the fire version. No, the water version. Such rapid fire requests. Show us your ninja powers already. Why do you pirates want to see it so badly? It's not because we're pirates. Huh? Frankie. Super! All boys like ninjas. And they're all smiling. We see Lazaro, oh, they're all Frankie. Oh, I all Usage is like me. Oh, they're all. Oh, oh, oh. And Frankie's just like, yeah. That makes me blush. Hey, have you ever gone out with a female ninja? Train your jumping ability by jumping over a bamboo shoot every day? Show me the shadow clone technique law. <gasps> oh! Hide in the ceiling and get stabbed by a spear. <gasps> Fly in the sky <laughs> with a cloth. <laughs> Giant frog. Hold a scroll in your mouth and say, Nin Nin. Oh, Rizo, Rizo, Rizo. Hurry up. Just do it. La and Zora want to see it, but they're just like, okay, show us ninja powers. Kah! Oh, shut up. Stop imposing your damn dreams on me. Uh, we ninja don't say things like nin nin. The ninja in your heads are all fantasies. What? <laughs> oh, the... They don't say that? <laughs> so what makes you a ninja? It can't be your physique. That's right. With this physique, I can't even attract female ninjas. Hey, shut up! <clears throat> Listen, it takes a quiet and tough mind to be a master ninja. We're supposed to be living in the shadows. We can't show off our techniques. Ninjutsu is not entertainment. And they're all sad. <laughs> Chopper Usopp and Luffy. Ah, <laughs> oh, and Ryza's is just like, ah. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, even Lon Zoro and Frankie. <laughs> Aka. Minpo smoke escape technique. Kra. Uh, he disappeared. What? Where did he go? I didn't disappear. Ugh. I'm here. What? What? Oh. Uh, uh. And here too. Here too. Here too. Uh oh. What? He got doubles. Could it be? <laughs> Ninpo Shadow Clone Technique. Cool. How's this? Can you catch me? There they go. What? There they go. They're just popping up all over the place. There's Luffy. You got him. I gotcha. How's this? Uh. Ninbo, body replacement technique. And he's running on the ceiling. Oh. He's unexpectedly agile. Don't you... Did you doubt I was really a ninja? Oh, he's, flower shuriken. Shinobi. Oh, he spelled it out with the shuriken and they're all impressed. And there they go, they're all his shadow clones are going back into his body. Never popular with girls, but still an invincible ninja. Rizo of the Mist is now Is now? I oh here you know, before your eyes Oh, everybody's hot. The ninja's so cool. Rizo! Chopper is literally crying with tears. Nin Nin! Wait, I thought they were supposed to say Nin Nin, Rizo. So we got Luffy's poster there at halfway point. Ba no no no! This is Robin's. Now we're outside, we get a view of the uh, whale tree. And Kinemon and Conjuro and Rizo walking. <laughs> Nin Nin, you're unbelievable. Luffy's just on top of him. Nin Nin, being a ninja isn't about how you look, but about your mind. Nin Nin, can I become a ninja if I train myself a lot? Nin Nin <laughs> Nin Nin <laughs> I want to see more ninjutsu Nin Nin Cut the Nin Nin crap <laughs> There's Chopper, Usopp and Luffy off of him You already saw my ninjutsu accidentally Accidentally? I know you did them for us these fools. Now they're walking on the tree. Still. There they are. Looks like they're at the edge to look over at the forest. Oh. Oh, and there's Rizo. And we see the town and the music playing. And then it just pans above and we see the whole city on the back of Zunisha. And then Kinemon, Conjuro are all clenching their mouths and trying not to cry. Same with Rizo. 
And when Chopper sees them, are you guys crying? Don't be silly. Men from the land of Wano, don't cry. It's just... It wasn't like this when I arrived here. Oh. oh, so we see Rizo arrive here, it looks like. Oh, we see the city all nice and everything. I really, I don't think we got this in the manga, did we? No. The city and the river were both beautiful. We see all the minks walking around town and everything. The streets were bustling. And people were living their lives and the whole country was full of energy now we see just all these minks shopping for food oh uh, this looks like the same thing we got before jack attacked when they were showing all the civilians going through their everyday lives well all the minks at least ah, I hit my table again sorry if the video is all jittery guys uh, and then we see the city transformed into how it is and all the people disappearing and all the buildings going from standing up, fading to crushed down. Uh, this is the same with all the rest of the city and... Oh, this music too. And seeing all this, it, it kind of does hit you right in the feels. And we see the markets all destroyed now. <coughs> All the people vanish out of frame, disappear, same with all the uh, shopping centers in like the market area it looks like. Oh no, this is, I think this is the song that was playing when Ace was saying, oh, when Ace was getting his final words, it sounds ex kind of like it. At least I think it is. And now we're just seeing all the forest destroyed and everything. Trees rubble in the rivers. Big uh, mammoth footprint there left by Jack. One tree's just like broken over hanging, not totally off the top of it. And then we see all of the town again and then the bird's eye view. Damn those minks. Why, what they did was so rash. I will work as hard as I can to avenge you. Are you just crying? So forgive me. Forgive me. Um, Kingy Mon. Is crying still, so is Conjuro. They're trying to hold in their tears, but they can't, and Chopper's just fucking, so as you saw, Luffy's just sitting there on the ground. Well, Chopper's sitting on the ground too, and they're looking at the city. And Luffy's just looking at it with that kind of smile on his face. Hey, you Gar guys. Seems like the deciphering of the stone is done. Come back into the whale. Here we go. So we're right inside now. We see the red poneglyph. What do you think, Nami? Is this what's written on the poneglyph? Yeah, I can draw a nautical chart based on this. We can pinpoint the location of something, Robin. That red stone is called a road poneglyph. Although guys of the sea are searching to the ends of the Grand Line, and that stone is a guide to get there.
The whale forest is considered sacred because of it. So it needs to be protected by us guardians. The end of the Grand Line? You mean a guide to the last island, Raftal? That's right. What? However, Raftal? That's the goal to become king of the pirates. Luffy's all excited. Finally, we can get there. The last island, Raftal? Oh, and then we get Crocus at the... That's the island the Flower Pops mentioned. Uh, does it say where Raftal is? Wait, wait, don't jump to conclusions. Hear me out, you see. Huh? There are four of those red stones, the road poneglyphs in the world. He's holding up the four. What? Does it mean there are four Raftals? No, there aren't. Let him finish first. Can you stop just slapping? <laughs> that stone must indicate the location of some unknown spot, but it's not Raftal. If he's just sitting there. The other three road poneglyphs all indicate different locations in the same manner. Oh, and then we see the map. When you learn where those locations are and connect those four points on a map. Oh, and then we see the four poneglyphs going. Those lines will cross at the center. And then we see some nice thing animation going on where Raftal would be. Zoro and everybody is just that's where the last island is. Only the King of the Pirates and his crew have reached it in all these centuries. And then we're and that's Raftal and it's just panning into a close view of Raftal. And then it the it just goes to Brooke's face. And then Frankie's just smiling. <laughs> so is Zoro. Choppers is like, yeah! Usopp, yeah! Nami's all happy! Oh, Robin's definitely happy. And Luffy's just like, haha! Yeah! The last island! Raftal! And then we see Raftal again there, surrounded in clouds and mystery, and then BOOM! To be Continued, guys. Let's go see what the trailers are for next week. Doop, 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 doop. The mystery of the Poneglyphs that Robin is searching for comes to light. When the conflict among the four emperors who are trying to get to Raftal and the deep connection between the Kozuki clan, including Momonosuke, and the Poneglyphs are revealed. Luffy will learn the samurai's great sorrow. On the next episode of One Piece, the secret of the land of Wano, the Kozuki family, and the Poneglyphs. I'm going to be the king of the pirates. Oh, and then we see Gold Roger at the end. Yo, we've seen Jack, though. Um, looks like he's... And we've seen Doflamingo, so it looks like uh, Jack's going to try and rescue Doflamingo. And oh my god, this video is half an hour long. I am so sorry, guys. I apologize for it being that long. Um, I really do appreciate you guys for watching this, if you guys did. Um, so yeah, uh, that does this. I uh, hope you guys all enjoyed my live reaction. Um, if you liked the live reaction, give it a like. If you disliked it, give it a dislike. Let me know why in the comments down below. Also, give me a little constructive criticism as well. And also, let me know your thoughts and opinions on episode, sorry, 769 of One Piece. Uh... I think it's the red poneglyph, uh, the road to find the one piece, I believe it was called. 
Um, I'll have the title it on the uh, video when it's uploaded. Um, and uh, yeah. Uh, also, let me know down below. Are you guys excited for One Piece Film Gold, and are you guys gonna go and see it in January? Um, when it comes to Canada and the United States. Um, and, uh, yeah, what are you expecting out of it? Um, because I believe this is the first time um, that we are getting a One Piece movie that gets released in Japan and then gets released in the States and Canada in English, not just subtitled. So it is English, which is phenomenal. I can't wait to see it. Um, I'm so excited. Like I said, I'm getting my tickets uh, this week for it. Um, so I can go and see it, um, well, I will let people know, um, <sighs> when I get my tickets, and if you're in my neighborhood, or in my city, and you guys are going, uh, just, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys there, and, uh, yeah, and, uh, yeah, subscribe to my channel if you're new, so you never miss a video from me, I do live reactions for multiple different anime and manga series, um, I, uh, or, you know, uh, and, uh, what was I just gonna, oh yeah, um, if you guys have any ideas for anime and manga you guys would like to see me do live reactions to, um, let me know in the comments down below, or let me know on my Twitter at FFBackup, link will be in the description down below, it is my Twitter for, uh, this YouTube channel, um, also, any Star Wars fans out there, anybody go and see, uh, Rogue One yet, um, I seen it, I loved it. Um, definitely seeing it a second time made me kind of appreciate it a little more. It, um, I'm not going to spoil it for anybody, but, um, especially with the ending, um, basically I'd say the last 10, 15 minutes of the movie, um, maybe even a little bit more than that, maybe I'd say the last half an hour is really, really good and action-packed and everything, but the last, I'd say, five to seven minutes. Um, are very, very awesome, um, and, uh, I just loved it, I loved it so much, but, uh, yeah, enough about that, um, sorry for this long video, guys, once again, um, I appreciate it if you guys checked it out, um, and, uh, yeah, I hope you guys all have a very wonderful and safe day, no matter what you guys decide to do, uh, tell all your friends that this episode of One Piece is out, if, uh, they haven't checked it out already, it is a really good episode. I liked it, um, even though it did kind of drag on. I really think that um, basically the only unnecessary thing in this whole episode is... Well, there's two. One, a five-minute and 40-second title card. Like, come on, Toei. Like, when you're getting close to six minutes and like that, when the episode is... So, let's see. This episode, if you go... If you watch it all the way to the end of the previews, it's 23 minutes and 55 seconds. So that means a total of 5 minutes and 40 seconds is just the opening and the post credit. And they stopped, and I'm pretty sure they did like a whole goddamn 30, 45 second thing where it was just the end of last week's episode with them getting introduced to Rizo and everything, which is... I mean, I understand where it is and everything, and, and animation is hard and everything, and I know, uh, guy, I was listening to the One Piece podcast, and, uh, somebody brought up the question, do you think maybe One Piece should be doing, uh, the filler, like, uh, like Naruto and Bleach did, where it's like a year of filler? Um, I would say yes, but no at the same time, I mean, yes, because it would be good for the long run, it'd help them get a lot, um instead of being like 30 to anywhere between 30 to 40 chapters behind um they could be more but um really honestly i think there is an easy way to fix this um you just do the uh you just do the uh, filler for the uh, jimmy cover story from the manga um if uh, nobody knows about that but uh yeah also no, the other thing that i was getting to that didn't need to be in here the flashback of robin in O'Hara and everything, um, I think the only new thing we got there, um, I can't really remember, um, it's been a while since I watched the whole O'Hara arc and everything, uh, Robin passed and everything, basically, but, um, I think the only new thing in there was, she used her power, she grabbed a book, 
and then she had her eyes on the wall as she was reading the book and everything with her hands, and then she was glancing over at the polyglyph, and we did see something going on there that might be brought up in the next episode, which um, isn't going to be really spoiler or anything, but um, they made the fish scale copy, which is they put that big piece of paper over it. You've seen Do Professor Clover doing it, and they basically, um, you know, it's basically like um, the paper where, like, you get your bill and somebody writes on it, and then on the other side it uh, has the indent of it. So basically they just put it over there, traced it, and that was it. But, uh, yeah, anyway... Sorry for this long video, just like going on rant sometimes, and, uh, yeah, uh, please don't text and drive, guys, uh, it's very dangerous. If you feel like it's that important, guys, please pull over to the side of the road, um, it can save your life, my life, somebody else's life, you never know what could happen in a blink of an eye or a snap of a finger, so please be, please, don't text and drive, if you feel like it's important, guys, pull over to the side of the road, or just wait until you get to your destination, it's as easy as that, and, uh, yeah, um, Without further ado, guys, uh, I guess that does this for this live reaction. I'll, I'll see you guys next time in the uh, next video that I'm going to be doing. I'll probably be doing my uh, Dragon Ball Super live reaction after this. So, uh, yeah. Um, until next time, guys, this is Pfeiffer at the back of out, saying uh, take care, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye.